Hello Summoners, welcome back to the channel and in this video we will be doing another tier list update for the month of February and I do say February but as you can see we are almost done with the month so you can treat it as early March tier list I guess because we usually wait for the second cha champion uh, to be released which was Misty Knight day before yesterday and overall I would say both the champions are in the same tier uh, this month because they are good characters they are definitely above average but at the same time they're not your must have uh, top tier champions that you should you know open caps for or go for in arena like some people obviously will like them and i'd say between the two caps sam wilson definitely has more potential i do kind of think that he has the potential to go here but it is still very early i will like to see some more gameplay out of him uh, I will say that in the PvP mode, a lot of people were using him and they were using him pretty effectively. So I think uh, he is definitely a champion you should keep an eye on. But for now, he is going to be in this tier. We didn't see any buffs this month once again. So not that much to talk about uh, in that department. I did make some changes based on the comment section of the previous video. Two champions were actually missing. First one was Icarus. The reason for that was because when he came out, he was bugged, so I uh, made the decision to not add him in the list, and then I guess I never added him. And uh, Icarus, I'd say, is again pretty much the same. Like for this deal, you can just say this that they are solid champions, but they are just better champions to invest your resources into if you have them, obviously. If you don't, then they can still get the job done. So, yeah, you should be happy if you pull them. Uh, with some of the things you have to make sure is there are champions like Black Bolt, who if you pull him initially without any synergies, he is pretty much dud and even with synergies you need to have him awaken you need to have him uh, ideally at a decent signature level like he definitely improves a lot so definitely keep in mind whatever things you're seeing here because they are uh, it's hard because the thing is like someone like black bolt without synergies would go in the buff please category but with the synergies he can you can he, he is top 5 dps in the entire game like i've done a best solos with him and he is pretty crazy like he can almost compete with champions like cosmic coast Strider, damage output wise uh so yeah a lot of champions like cable without synergies absolute trash with synergies absolute god so uh, do keep uh, these legends in mind make sure to read them what do you need for them to be good and there could be some missing like iron fist for example uh, i'd say he uh, depending on what synergies you're running with can be again i promoted him to usable but he can be even better than that he can even cheese a lot of fights with his tunnel log it's not guaranteed but it's there uh so yeah but i get distracted so easily i was talking about the changes i made based on the comment section and also mentioning that if you want some changes to be made to this list do leave them out in the comment section down below because i do read them and if i agree then i do make the changes as well uh, so the two champions that got upgraded well not spider ham spider ham was already here miles morales and mr fantastic i think both were like well deserved buffs uh, miles morales without the spider ham synergy the damage output is much lower than with spider ham synergy but even on his own the utility that he brings and even the damage it's not like you can't get the furies um like i personally have a hard time to get all the furies at the same time the combo thing you have to you can intercept and get it faster there's a lot to keep in mind but he's pretty fun to play uh, i always like champions that have these mission sort of things so yeah that's cool and mr fantastic again also very solid champion a lot of people just see him as a synergy champion but he is more than that after his buff he's very solid on offense by himself uh, like with all those debuffs and the massive fury that he gets he can hit really really hard and he again brings even thing uh, like he even brings things for the team uh, as a synergy uh, champion and uh, then uh, we i think uh, yeah we also added this column dps thing <laughs> it would seem weird to some people like some champions at the top here uh, like rocket raccoon would be surprising this is against like this is first of all 565 so if you got someone down with like 20 seconds uh as a rank 3 6 star so this, these are just times like i've taken from my damage comparisons 
uh, I I can like if you have better times using a 565 with you sides uh, with any synergies I, I mentioned the synergies here in the note section and uh, it's not a complete list we have 74 to do uh, 73 champions listed here and OG cap at the bottom with the note died from few sides a few times buff please I think that is a pretty ideal note for him uh, but you can see uh, there are some surprising champions like Storm up here and this is against again Realm of Legend when Soldier which is not a very long fight. Storm in a very long fight would definitely be even stronger because the damage over time just gets up and up and up. Uh, and uh, then similarly you can see uh, this for yourself. Uh, it, it's not a perfect list. It does We are not including champions like Corvus because uh, he would suck against Winter Soldier and uh, like yeah I, I don't know how to put Corvus here and champions to require the ramp up and stuff I'm, I'm kind of still thinking about that I think I have Star Lord here uh, but then he doesn't really carry over his damage so it's fine but I guess yeah that, that's pretty much it synergy stab if you didn't see uh, last time the anything that has a hand trick there's some videos here as well if you want to see them very few champions have them but some of them are kind of useful i'd say if i saw so myself like quake parry style versus deck style comparison and stuff so yeah you can check all of that out i will leave a link to the list in the description and also the pinned comment but uh, yeah, that's pretty much it i will scroll down if you want to see the complete list you can again go to it from the description and uh, why is this like this i do not know like it, it's kind of weird but all right that's pretty much gonna do it for this one thanks for watching have a nice day subscribe to the channel for more content like this video share with the land stay safe have a good one and bye bye also not related to the tier list uh, i have been talking about it in the community section i have been loving this game played it like this is why no video came to the channel yesterday um elden ring absolutely amazing game be the first main boss and uh, yeah I've, I've been having a lot of fun with this but not really related to marvel contest of champions or a tier list but wants to add it i don't know why but yeah that's gonna do it bye bye